What happens when you take these things, ketones, exogenous ketones, when you're not on a ketogenic diet? I am Dr. Anthony Gasson, and I'm here to let you know. So, number one, you are not going to die. So, that, that's the good news. Um, a lot of people think that if you have any kind of carbohydrates or you're not in a state of ketosis and you use exogenous ketones, that you're basically going to explode. It's just, it's not the case. So, what happens is that your body can actually run on, on different fuels at the same time. So, different tissues prefer different fuels. So for instance, some of your muscles, your heart and your brain actually prefer ketones even in the presence of carbohydrates. And so if you're eating an even moderate carbohydrate, high carbohydrate diet, and you have exogenous ketones, um, that's, uh, your, your body can use that stuff. And so you can notice some benefits. So you can notice that stuff. That even if you're on a high carb diet and you have ketones, no one's not gonna erase all the carbs you just ate but your brain's gonna start uptaking this stuff and use it as a better fuel. So a lot of people use it, it's kind of like this brain enhancement or a nootropic type of effect, where they have a scoop of ketones and you can feel your brain working faster. You can feel yourself speaking more clearly. And these are the things that, it's very clear that your body's using that even if you have carbohydrates. Um, what happens to the carbohydrates or to the ketones? Same type of process. So you're not gonna store ketones as fat, and that's kind of another big myth just because the conversion of a ketone back into a fatty acid is really, really inefficient, especially from beta-hydroxybutyrate, which is what the exogenous ketone actually is. And so your body can use it. If it doesn't use it, if it doesn't use it all up, um, then you'll start, you know, you'll just pee it out, or you might have a little GI distress. So if you're taking a lot of exogenous ketones and your body's not in a state of ketosis, um, you're gonna have probably some GI upset, but not if you've been taking them for a while. And so, Yes, you can coexist with having carbohydrates and having ketones at the same time, um, as well as athletic performance. You can have a huge benefit from using ketones with athletic performance. A lot of people call it like a dual fuel system where you're using both ketones and carbohydrates at the same time. Um, a lot of people, when they have ketone esters, so uh, endurance athletes, this is a, like a liquid ketone that's really, really disgusting, but really jacks your ketones up. Also take that with carbohydrates so they can use both the carbohydrates for explosive endurance, but also ketones for kind of like the slower, um, more oxygen heavy uh, workouts and movements that you need to do. So answer is yes, it's completely safe. You're not gonna be screwing anything up. You're not gonna make the carbohydrates move to fat magically. Carbohydrates are gonna be metabolized the same exact way. Ketones are gonna be in there kind of like as a supplement and fill in all the gaps of heart tissue, some muscles, and then your brain. And yeah, I mean, so that's the thing. Try it out. Um, we have had, I mean, there's a lot of companies that have had um, ketone supplements out there for many, many years, literally hundreds of millions of doses that have been taken. I think that if this is something that was dangerous, people would know by now. And there's been tons of research on that. So if you guys are interested in that, head to scholar.google.com, pubmed.gov, tons of stuff out there, um, not, not dangerous and could be actually advantageous in a lot of times. So if you don't want to eat ketogenic diet all the time, you want some targeted benefits, like for instance, if you want increased focus, mental clarity, some performance, great. It's not gonna help you magically erase the carbohydrates or magically lose fat just because you took the supplement, uh, but it's gonna help out a lot of different areas. So if you have any questions, concerns about ketones and how to use them, just pop a comment below or shoot me a message on Instagram at DRAnthonyGustin. I answer every single message on there and we will see you guys next time.